The president of the Ghana Paralympic Committee, Mr. Samson Dean, believes an increase in investment in power sports can boost the country's performance at the upcoming 2024 Olympics in Paris. A five-member para-athletics team left Ghana for Morocco to participate in the 2024 Marrakesh World Para-Athletics Grand Prix competition. The tournament was part of the qualification event for the Paris 2024 Paralympic Games. The team is back after securing three medals, including two gold and a bronze medal, led by coach Ibrahim Aminu Suleiman and the team comprised Edmund Govina, who participated in the men's F44 and 46 shot put, T60 javelin and F46 discus throw, Amos Ahiaga in the men's T4600 meters, T46 long jump, T46200 meters and T46400 meters with Diana Kubetiga competing in the women's T46 800 meters, T46 1500 meters. Zainab Isa participated in the women's F57 discus, F57 shot put and F57 javelin. Veteran at Zinabu Isa emerged as Ghana's star performer dominating the women's F57 shots put and discuss events. Isa secured two gold medals in both categories, setting personal best with throws of 7.94 meters in the shot put and 26.66 meters in the discus. Edmund Govina added to Ghana's medal hall with a bronze medal in the men's F46 discus throw. Coach of the side, Ibrahim Aminu Suleiman, hopes to improve in the upcoming global event. I'm supposed to have three gold, one bronze. But we did our best. We get two gold and one bronze. Please, please, media us. Please, please, again. We need your support. Without you, no one can see us. We want you to market us. We get, we get sponsors. President of the Ghana Paralympic Committee, Mr. Samson Dean, praised the athletes and said, with more government support, athletes can compete at higher levels and vie for medals among the world best. The qualification is a process. You need to get two qualifications from our own assessment and our own boardroom discussions and how we are looking at it. We are looking at at least having two athletes from para-athletics, one male, one female. For para powerlifting, we are possibly to get three of our athletes. Uh, para taekwondo, there will be a bipartite slot, which we know. Because of competitions, the athletes there have been able to go and uh, attempted. We are going to get one from taekwondo. The blind sport will give us one para cycling through bipartite. So with all this, and then uh, just three days ago, I had a good hint of the para badminton events that they went in Uganda. And for that matter, we have received the documents to, uh, to apply for the bipartite for the athlete. So in all, we are looking at about eight of our athletes at the Paris Games. If we should let our athletes stay in camp for the next three months, I can assure you we would do much, much better than go and do well. The 2024 Summer Paralympics is set to take place from August 28 to September 8 in France.